Thousands of incoming freshmen at Baylor University moved into their dorms today. That's right. Students, faculty, and staff welcomed the first year students to their new home, and parents said their goodbyes. Fox 44's PJ Hessner was there to see the emotions behind the move to BU. It's move in day for the incoming Baylor Bear freshmen who are very excited to meet their new roommates. Hey, sick of bears. <laughs> For the incoming freshmen at Baylor University, Move to BU starts the beginning of their Baylor journey. Over the next two days, 3,800 first year students will make the Baylor campus their home. Thousands of people. It was unbelievable. Huge class coming in. And we only saw a portion of the people that are actually going to move in total for the whole year. Students, faculty, and staff, and volunteers from the Baylor community are there to ensure that all their belongings are unloaded and delivered to their room while they go through the check in process. Lots of excitement, a great hyped crowd, a bunch of the kids who are already here have already been here before, and so they come out and they're, and they're jumping up, yelling, screaming, and cheering for everybody coming in, and then the freshmen, you know, they come a little bit nervous at first, but then they, you know, they glow up and they see everybody, so they get excited and they start yelling too. For some incoming freshmen, going to college not only means a new town, but a new country. For Timothy and his family, his journey to Baylor started with a 22-hour plane ride from Brazil. He researched it. It's Baylor. I want to go to Texas. And I said, Texas? <laughs> it's far. <laughs> the decision confused Timothy's mom, but she wasted no time preparing for her son to step foot on the Baylor campus. He has to follow his dreams, and we have to support him. And it's that. Uh -huh. He made it. Air impression. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Emotions and spirits are high, but the stress levels aren't there quite yet for the Baylor Bears because school hasn't started quite yet. In Waco, PJ Hessner, Fox 44 News.